everybody, I am Sophie and today I'm going to tell you five surprising facts about being a child actor. A quick little backstory, I am from Toronto, Canada and I have been an actor since I was a kid. When I was 11 years old, I got cast in a TV show that filmed all the way in Melbourne, Australia. So a lot of these rules that I'm going to talk about will vary slightly from country to country, so look up the rules in your region if you're curious. Number one is that hours are limited, especially for kids. Under the age of 18, you won't be able to work more than an eight hour day with a one hour lunch break, but the rules will continue to change. For example, if you're under hot, hot lights, there are often rules on how many hours you're able to be under those lights before you need a break. Number two is that you always need a guardian on set. As a minor, you need someone to be there to legally represent you as an adult. So oftentimes it will be the child's parent, but if they're unavailable on a shoot day, it can sometimes be a family friend or an older sibling, that kind of thing. Number three is my least favorite, but it's very true and I have firsthand experience with it, is that there is always judgment about being a child actor. There will always be times when people will judge you and your family for the decision to have you be a child actor. And whilst I completely get it and everyone's able to have their own opinion, of it. It was tricky because I actually had a lot of friends of the family and even family members who were adults telling me personally as a child how they disagreed with the decision. Number four, schooling doesn't stop. A lot of people over the years have asked me if I was homeschooled, if I just didn't get an education, and the answer is no. In Canada, in Australia, in the US, and many countries around the world, schooling rules on film sets are extremely, extremely tight. If you're on film sets for an extended period of time, then the production has to have a tutor on set who will work with your individual curriculum and ensure that you're getting the hours required to keep up with the schooling. I will say learning on a film set in a small room with other students with completely different schools, um, it, it was a little tough. Number five, a lot of people ask me if I wore makeup on the shows and the answer is yes. Doesn't matter your gender, your age, or if your character would never wear a drop of makeup in their life, you are sitting on that makeup chair and you're getting makeup on. This ensures that your skin looks really good under the lighting because often they will do things that don't look very natural in the daylight but look really, really good on camera. So every single morning from a very young age on, I was sitting in that makeup chair getting some bit of makeup on my face. There you go, those are my five surprising facts about being a child actor. They're questions I often get and people are really curious about, so I thought I would put them all into this video and let you know. If you guys have any requests, let me know in the comments down below. And thank you so much for taking the time to watch. I'll see you next time.